Hi, today I'm cooking pork ribs on the Workhorse Pit 69. Uh, I've got some swift St. Louis style cut ribs and we're going to sprinkle with some good rub Texas AF salt and pepper and some uh, gospel all-purpose rub. So let's carry on with trimming of the pork if it needs any, uh, put the rub on and then we'll get off to the smoker. See you shortly. Okay, so let's open this up and see what we've got. Usually they don't take much trimming. rid of some of this fat off here. If you can hear the kids next door, and they seem to be enjoying themselves. bit breezy out here. This is quite thin so we'll get rid of some of this. And we'll see about getting this membrane off. With a bit of luck, oh no, I was going to say we spoke too soon. With a bit of luck, we'll get it off in one bit. It's coming. Should have brought some uh, kitchen roll out with me, but never mind. We'll get there. There we go, at last. Where there's a well, there's a way. Get rid of some of this fat here. So put a little bit of salt and pepper on first. Not much. Make sure it goes on the sides. And then we'll put some of the gospel all-purpose rub. Put quite a good coat of this on. Not used this on the ribs before. So it'll be interesting to see how it goes. And again, put the salt and pepper on first. And then hit it with the, the uh, 
Me Church Gospel. Not forgetting the sides. That's looking good. We'll leave it to wetten up a little bit, get the smoke fired up and put it on. Okay, so let's get the fire started. We've just got some butcher's paper that had been soaked in tallow from a previous cook and some oak splits. Shouldn't take too long to get going. I'll just give it a help at this end. Okay, so the pork's all ready, the rub's on, it's looking nice and wet. The smoke is getting up to temperature, so we'll put the ribs on and let's see how it goes. Put it on at the smokestack end and um, yeah. Let's see how it goes in an hour or so, and then we'll come back to you. Okay, we're four hours in. Let's see how the ribs are doing. Wow. Look at the bark on that. Oh, it's rendering nicely. They're looking really good. I think I'll give them a spritz in a minute. And um, probably wrap them in another hour. Oh, the dogs are going mad. Okay, let's see if these ribs are ready for wrapping. Oh, they've rendered down really well. Yep, I think they'll be okay for wrapping. Looking at the ribs, there's some really nice colour. Nice bend to them, the rendering really, really well. So we'll put some of the jaws on the bottom and put them in for maybe half an hour.
let's get them back on the smoker. Okay, time to get the ribs off. They've been in the uh, foil now for about half an hour, so hopefully uh, should have set. Um, let's see what we've got. We've got a nice bend to them. Let's see. Juicy. They look good. Okay. Let's have a look. Oh, just gone through a bone there. That's not, not a good start, is it? Let's try this one. juicy. That's really juicy. Let's have a bite. Very, very good. <laughs> 